What are benefits of getting married? Jazakallah. Well, I've said the benefits is to protect yourself and I've said a few things. And apart from what I've said is, the one thing I said in the talk is the Akhirah. Akhirah. You will want to help one another in attaining the best of the Akhirah. How? You will want to basically look after one another. Everything in marriage is rewarding. In Sahih al-Bukhari, in Sahih al-Bukhari, there's a hadith where Rasulullah SAW says, Hatta ma tarfa ila fi fimra'atik. He says, even if you take a small lump of food and you put it to your wife's mouth, even jokingly to your wife's mouth, Allah will give you a reward for that. Allah will give you a reward. You know how much reward there is in marriage? There's reward in that. A woman, Rasulullah SAW says, her pregnancy, her delivery, the weaning of the child. Every moment of all these stages, she gets the same reward as a person in jihad fi sabilillah. And a person, a man fighting in the, in the path of Allah, she gets the same reward as that. Subhanallah, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, that sahabu was sitting, said, Mashim of Allah. They said, the, the, um, the rich people, the rich people have taken all the reward. He said, how? So, well, they fast, we fast, they pray, we pray, but they've got money which they can give in sadaqah, and we can't, we, we're poor, we haven't got that money. So they beat us in this. How can we beat them? You know what the Prophet said? He said, hasn't Allah made you ways of doing your, giving your sadaqah? They said, how? Allah's Messenger said, you say every subhanallah you say is sadaqah, every alhamdulillah is sadaqah, every la ilaha illallah is sadaqah, every Allahu Akbar is a sadaqah. He said, even if you sleep with your wives, is a sadaqah. They said, Mashim Allah. What are you saying? You're saying we sleep with them, we get reward for it? Prophet said, Awara'aytum, don't you see that if the man slept with a woman outside marriage, is it not a sin for him? They said, yes. He said, Kadal, if he sleeps with her in marriage, after marriage, it's a reward. Subhanallah. You sleep with your wife, the reward in that. You wake your wife of in tahajjud, a hadith in Abu Dawood, Rasulullah said, Allah have mercy on the man who wakes his wife of a tahajjud or wife who wakes her husband of a tahajjud and they don't get up so he gets a bit of water and sprinkles it on the face just to get them up for the akhirah. I'm not talking about buckets of water, right guys? Yeah? So a bit of sprinkle of water to get them up. Allah's Messenger said, Rahim Allah, Allah will have mercy on those. And what is marriage after you pass away? After you pass away, look, you're going to have children. The children, subhanAllah, Rasulullah said, you're in your grave, you're in your grave. Nothing can benefit you except for three things. One of those three things he said, if you've got a righteous child praying for you. Where does that come from? From your wife. You and your wife together, your righteous child. Get them up. They are your zakhira, they are your provisions for the next life. 